Here's a look at the forecast as we go into the weekend. There will be rain in Eda Dodge, but not a weekend by any means, and not a washout by any means. Uh, we start off in the low to mid 40s, and rain will be present early in the day, but look for a high temperature to be in the low 60s. It's a mild day tomorrow before cooler weather moves on in. Let me map it out for you. So we're mainly dry this evening other than a stray shower here or there. It's tomorrow morning, 8 o'clock. Some rain begins to move into the mountains and then into the upstate around 11 o'clock or 10 o'clock, and it continues to stream out of our area between say 12 and 2 by 1 30. Most of the upstates dry. So if you're going to those early Christmas parades, there will be rain for the first part of Saturday. Hit and miss, not a complete washout, but by lunchtime and beyond, we're mainly dry, including for the Greenville Christmas parade, where we even have a little bit of clearing out there. Now going deeper into the forecast, Sunday is a different story. We're behind that front, so temperatures begin to get cold again. Highs on Sunday will only be in the 50s. We'll have some clouds in place and a stray shower by late Late day. Let me show you what happens as we go into Monday because more changes begin to move our way. So think a cool day Sunday and a cool day Monday with that northeast wind, but a warm front's lifting back into our area Monday night. That's going to open the door for more rain. Looks like it's heavy Monday night into Tuesday where that rain could be pretty widespread across the area. By Tuesday night into Wednesday, that warm front's north of us, so we're actually beginning to warm things back into the low to mid 60s, but rain chances stick around. It won't be a complete washout, and there's a better chance for rain in the mountains mountains on Wednesday, but rain still sticking around through Thursday. Even it takes another cold front to come through to finally get some of this out of here. However, most of next week looks pretty unsettled, and it's this cold front right here that will determine our weather going into next weekend. Some of the models have it hanging back across our area as well, but you've got cold air on the other side of that front, which could mean a little bit of interesting weather to watch for the mountains, especially the higher elevations. We'll keep an eye on that. The four day looks like this a 40% chance of mainly morning showers on Saturday, 61 cooler on Sunday at 55 degrees, some late day showers on Monday, but most of the days dry, but rain heavy at times Monday night into Tuesday, off and on on Wednesday, Thursday and into Friday with temperatures returning back to the 60s. In Western North Carolina, we've got some showers on Saturday scattered about town dry on Sunday, but rain returns Monday night, especially going into Tuesday.